Hi, my name is Rachel Flatt and I'm a figure skater and I've been skating since I was about four years old and I chose to skate because I love to do it at the Power Springs Royal Arena and I practice about an hour of high skimmer take um, at either uh, the rink or the OTC or that I work with are Tom Zakrasia, Becky Calvin, Becky Bradley, Eric Schultz, and Eddie Zubstaff. Um, you know, they all work on different aspects of my skating um, and help to improve me on the you know, details. My name is Tom Zakrysiak. I'm the head coach at the Colorado Springs World Arena, and I coach Rachel Flat. Well, I compete internationally, so I compete with the best uh, junior and senior skaters in the world. Um, at junior, when I won Junior Worlds, I competed with um, the best junior skaters in the world. And um, and then this next year, I'll be skating at Senior Worlds, which is the best of the best, so yeah. <laughs> it'll be really exciting. I think Rachel's a very exceptional young teenager. Not only is she one of the best female figure skaters in the world, but she's also a very bright and dedicated student. Past year I've gone to The Hague in the Netherlands, um, Vienna, Austria, Chemnitz, Germany, Tokyo, Japan, and Sofia, Bulgaria, along with various states in the US. Rachel competed nine times this year, and only four of those competitions were in the United States, and the rest of those competitions were either in Europe or Asia, so she traveled a lot uh, internationally. Work, um, discipline, motivation, and you really have to have a good passion for it. And, um, I practice anywhere from three to four hours a day on ice. Rachel trains very hard. She works about 30 hours a week, both on the ice and off the ice. And so that means at the end of her day, she's pretty much exhausted, ready for dinner, some, a little bit of homework, and then sleep. You, in figure skating, you have to convince the judges and the technical panel that you deserve the points that you get. And she definitely has done that in most of her competitions this year. That said, she did come up short a few times. And so what Rachel must do in this next year and the year leading up to the Olympics is to work on being more convincing and that way she'll get more points and she'll win more often. My advice for any young person is to find something that they're really passionate about and go for it with 100% commitment and uh, make themselves a success. Representing the Partners Skating Club, Rachel Flatt!